Hey everybody, welcome back. So it's been a couple of days since I uploaded. So firstly, I just want to apologize for that. Um, it was for good reason. So I had the honor of being approached by somebody that I'm friendly with um, through YouTube. And she asked if I'd be interested not only in doing a collab, but in um, building the exterior for the collab. So I don't want to give away too much information. I haven't confirmed everything with her yet about if I could really talk about it. But basically, um, I've been working on this really big build and I needed to get it done in a certain amount of time. That way we can get moving on it. So that's all I'll say about that. But be on the lookout for that. I'll have more information um, in the coming weeks about all the details as far as that goes. So anyways, um, there was a couple of things I definitely wanted to talk about. Okay, so I wrote it down this time because I always forget uh, when I certain things that I want to talk to you guys about and I just kind of let whatever is on my mind flow out and that's what ends up being my recording. So one other thing that I want to tell you guys is a friend of mine that I became friendly with through Instagram just started a YouTube channel. Um, so right now she just has one video up on her channel but I'd really love for you guys to go and check it out her name is Captain Nim so it's C-A P like Peter T like Thomas N like Nancy N like Nancy Y M like Mary I'm gonna leave the info I'll link her um, YouTube channel in the description box but um, if you guys are into Pokemon she actually made this awesome uh, build with pokeballs so she did sort of like a tutorial speed build kind of for that build so it's really 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 cool I'm obsessed with it it's one of the most unique things I've ever seen um, as far as a build goes in the sim so like I said I'm gonna link it down below please go and show her some support welcome her into the YouTube community um, a little bit about this build so this is obviously a tiny build which you know I don't do too many of these, but um, since I hadn't posted anything in four days, I wanted to get some new content out to you guys, so I just did this quick little build. I didn't go too crazy with decorating it on the inside. I used a lot of stuff from Realm of Magic because anytime I do some sort of whimsical cottage or anything like that, I just feel like the stuff from Realm of Magic just goes really, really well. And I've been dying to do something with this cool like sloped roof that you see in the front and I just figured this would be a good time to use it so um, this is also a kind of roofing that would be really great if you're doing some sort of like a Tudor style or like a house that you might see in Germany or something like that so this might reappear in another video soon because I love the way that the roof looks I just think it's a really cool really unique look um, I've talked to people from all over the world through Instagram and so many people have said to me, oh, the houses in America are so beautiful. I love the houses in America, but yeah, there's a lot of really beautiful houses here. Um, I live in New York, so there's a lot of, I guess you could say fancy areas um, in neighboring towns where I live. And I see a lot of mansions often. Um, we're on the water, so I do see a lot of water, uh, water. I do see a lot of like beach house looking houses and stuff, but they're not like, um, I guess unique, you could say. I don't know if it's just because it's what I'm used to seeing, but when I see stuff from other countries, um, and the way that they're built and just the craftsmanship that goes into some of these houses, it just kind of blows me away. And I think it's so much better, I guess you could say, than what you see here, um, in New York. I don't know. It's just what's off the top of my head what I was thinking about um, but anyway so I kept this I used some stuff from the nifty knitting pack I really love this pack um, I'm hearing a lot of mixed reviews about um, you know the stuff that came in it as far as color palette which I touched on and if not the last video maybe a couple of videos ago um, but I happen to like it I wish there was more wood tones but besides that it is what it is I think it's cute but that's also because I like to use a lot of color in my builds um, and some people were talking about what the graphics look like uh, I haven't really noticed too much of an issue with the graphics I think everything looks pretty beautiful but 
who knows? I mean, everybody has their own opinions, each his own. So, um, I did another build poll on my Instagram. So I don't know what's coming up. Um, right now it's literally 50, 50, but I gave a choice of a desert home or a Sulani home because I haven't done anything in Sulani in a long time. And I always like to build in the desert. So we'll see what comes up. Um, I have to think of some ideas for both of them first. That way I actually have something to build once I get a final answer. Um, so I'll probably start on something tomorrow. And I've been thinking a lot about uh, having a schedule for you guys. And it's really difficult for me to do that. Um, the reason being, number one, is I'm always involved in a lot of different collaborations. Those all have different dates and I work on those you know, when I have the spare time, which I don't really have a lot of spare time anyways, between taking care of my son and just keeping clean house and, you know, just doing regular builds, um, to fit in these extra ones that are not obviously going on YouTube right away and video editing and all that stuff. <clears throat> it's definitely hard for me to figure out a schedule. And also when I do big builds, which you guys know that I do a lot of big builds, they can take me one day, two days, three days, sometimes four days. So I don't want to promise you guys a set schedule um, and not be able to fulfill that. So what I want to still keep saying for now is I think I've been able to get you two, sometimes three videos a week. Um, so let me know what you guys think. If I can get on some sort of schedule, let me know if you guys would prefer a schedule or you guys just think whenever you get a build to us, you get a build to us. I'd really like to know down in the comment section. Um, yeah, just, I want to hear from you guys. So also let me know what you think of this build. Um, I'm still waiting for <clears throat> me, myself to have some time to do another tutorial. Um, the reason that's so hard for me is again, I have a child and he can be very noisy sometimes. So, um, I can't just sort of, you know, record when he's sleeping, he'll wake up, he'll hear me talking. So, um, I can't do that, you know, and when I do record, he's obviously awake and sometimes he makes a lot of noise. So when that happens, I have to stop recording, start all over again and all that. So <clears throat> it's hard for me to find the time, but when I do find the time to do it, I'd really like to know what else you guys would like to see. So I do want to do like a roofing tutorial. I definitely still want to do that landscaping tutorial I talked to you about, but I want to know what kind of roofing tutorial you guys want to see, because there's so many different styles and shapes and I guess issues that people run into when they're roofing. So let me know. Um, by the way, I'm obsessed with this green color I use for the house. So anyways, I can't believe I talked for the whole video. I never do that. I usually am in and out, but this was a short video because it's a small build. So I hope you all have a great day. Thanks for stopping by and watching the video. Please hit that like button. Like I said, please go visit my friend's YouTube page and please subscribe if you haven't already. I hope you have a great day. Bye.